Good morning, this is Pastor Lynn with Goodland United Methodist Church. Time once again for Breakfast with God. There's that scripture in the Bible in Matthew 6 that gives us a prayer that God had given to the disciples. And one of the lines in that prayer is simply this, Forgive us our debts as we have forgiven our debtors. It's hard to start the day when you are still carrying around a hurt you have not forgiven. One morning, Denise Stovall's daughter, Deanna, taught her a special lesson about forgiveness. Mama, how do you spell Lewis? Deanna asked as she rushed into the kitchen. Lewis? Who's Lewis? asked her mother. You know, said the five-year-old, he's the boy who gave me the black eye. For several days, Denise had asked herself, How a child could be so mean to another child. Anger sizzled inside her every time she saw the black and blue mark on her daughter's hazel eye. Slamming the oven door closed as if it were a person in question, she said, Why on earth do you want to know how to spell his name, especially after what he did to you? Deanna's reply reminded her mother of why Jesus said, Let the little children come unto me, for of such is the kingdom of heaven. Well, at church yesterday, Miss May told us we should make paper chains for All Saints Day. She said to make a ring every time somebody does a nice thing like Jesus did, and then put that person's name on the ring. Lewis told me on the bus today that he was sorry he hit me in my eye. And that was nice. I want to put his name on this ring and make it part of the chain so we can pray for him so he won't do it again. As her mother stood in the middle of the kitchen with her hands on her hips, the words of a recent sermon came back to convict her. Forgiveness no matter how long it takes or how difficult it is to attain, is the only path to healing and freedom. Upon reflection, she thought Deanna's bruised eyelid looked just a little better. Before you start the day, make certain that you are free from all unforgiveness and offense. Remember how much God has forgiven you? It will be easier to forgive others, even if it's a black eye. When someone says they're sorry, they're worth being forgiven. This is Pastor Lynn with Goodland United Methodist Church.